All right, here we have a U.S. Mint Department of Treasurer, Captain John Paul Jones coin. Look at that. Beautiful. Even down to the buttons on his uniform. Isn't that something? The details. That's what's important about some of these coins. Is the detail that they put into creating them. Which makes them U.S. Mint. Isn't that something? Love it. Alright, let me show you the other side of this coin. And this is amazing. Look at this ship. Wow. Isn't that something? Look at all the details in this ship. All the sails. You know some of the sails are not always 100% perfect view. And that's how they made it too. As you can see right there and right there. They're not all perfect. Isn't that nice? I love the view of this. This is pretty. Very good. I made a good trade with my friend in Florida for some stamps for these coins. It's always surprising to see what he sends me. I send him the stamps he wants. He sends me surprises. It's like getting a Christmas gift in the mail all the time. And I like my gifts very much. All right. Bye-bye now. Be sure to share. Be sure to join me as a friend. All right. Bye. Okay, today we have a very special coin to show you. Uh, this is a token made from a cannon of World War II, a German cannon. The cannon was captured, really. I don't think it ran away too much. But here's a Victory Liberty Loan coin. You see, it probably wore it on that necklace, that chain. Okay. It says awarded by the U.S. Treasurer Department for patriotic service in behalf of the Liberty Loans made from captured German cannon. Look at that. Isn't that just something to have such a coin like that? All right, I hope you've enjoyed my bringing this to you. This was a really good find. And go ahead and share this with others who are great coin collectors. You might be interested in seeing this. Not everyone gets to see one of these. Come across them. They are very unique. All right. Bye-bye now. Cornel de Fleury for Colonel U.S. Mint Department of Treasurer and here's the beautiful coin. Look at that. Showing you a fort on the mountain by the water. Look at all the ships in the water. Isn't that nice? What's good about these coins is there's always a lot of details to really stop and look at. 
This is all part of a trade for stamps from my friend in Florida. Very nice. Now let me show you the other side of the coin. Look at that. Isn't that amazing? Look at the details into making this coin. Very beautiful. Hope you've enjoyed my bringing this to you. Be sure to sub me, join me as a friend, and I'll bring you some more beautiful coins from my friend in Florida. It was a great trade for stamps. All right, bye bye now. Okay, here we are bringing you General Horatio Gates, U.S. Mint Department of Treasurer. His beautiful coin. Look at that. Isn't that beautiful? I like how they have the black to bring out the silver uh, this, of his, you know, it's like a silhouette type thing. Brings out all the letters very nice. And his photo. Isn't that beautiful? They're all made just a little bit different, but they're really nice to collect. Good one. Alright, now let me show you the back side of this coin. And look at the details on that. Wow. Very nice indeed, isn't it? Pretty. It's really great to collect these coins. Alright, hope you've enjoyed my bringing them to you. Be sure to sub me, join me as a friend, and as always, share with others. Let them all see these beautiful coins. Alright, bye bye now. Alright, here we have U.S. Mint Department of Treasurer General Nathaniel Green coin. Look at this beautiful coin. Isn't that nice? Look at all the details in it. It's really a good size too. Very nice coin. You can even see the button of his shirt and everything. All the details in it. Very nice. This is a tray from my friend in Florida. A stamp. And this is the back side of the coin. Look at all the little details. The flag, the cross, the book. Don't just look at the main picture. Look at all the details that go with that. Very nice coin. Alright, I hope you've enjoyed my bringing this to you. Stay tuned for more because we do have a lot more coins. Alright, bye bye now. Okay, here we have U.S. Mint Department of Treasurer Lieutenant, Lieutenant Colonel William Washington. Look at this. How's that for proper? Look at the details in this. We're all marching on. Angel watching over them. Look at that. What an unreal coin. To be able to get that much detail in this tiny little coin. Beautiful. Get the flags and everything all there. All the horses. Look at the detail on the horse. Beautiful, huh? Just love that. 
made some really nice coins. Beautiful. All right, let's look at the back side of this coin. This happens to have a saying on it. For all those of you who can read this. I hope you I like how they have the whole wreath thing going around. Very nice. Made for an elegant saying. Alright, I hope you've enjoyed my bringing this to you. Be sure to sub me, join me as a friend. And this was part of a trade. For stamps for my friend in Florida. Bye bye now. Alright, here we are. U.S. Mint Department of Treasurer General Anthony Wayne coin. Look at that. Look at all the detail in their clothes and stuff that's in there. Even the shield. Look how the knees are and everything. All the tiny details. When you look at coins, I mean, do you just look at, oh, it's a good coin? Or do you look at the details? I like looking at all the details that it took to create the coin. Very interesting. It makes it a lot more interesting anyhow. Alright. So this is one side. Now let me show you the other side. And look at the details in that. Clouds to the land, all the soldiers, a lot of details, so nice, stony point, very nice, these coins are always great to collect, they're really good size, they're beautiful cases, they're really nice. And this was a nice trade for stamps from my friend in Florida. I love these coins. Alright. Be sure to sub me now. Share with others. And we'll bring you some more. Bye-bye now.